I would I would suggest uh, please please uh, focus uh, on finding a project that has an opportunity for faster data generation or you may mobilize the turnaround time. Um, ito, if I may say this also that you don't actually need to look far far and wide for ano for a process improvement to work on. Uh, too often the project uh, is actually right in front of you, like an assigned task or possible a process that your role is involved in. Um, pero this process or task actually irks or annoys you. Yung tipong how you wish na sana may mabilis or may magandang paraan para gawin ito. And you know, you might, um, you, baka, baka ikaw lang yung hinihintay para improve yung ano yung task na yan, right? So, there. So, please keep it simple. Now, number two, um, I would recommend um, and highly recommend, please do coaching uh, when you start your project. Um, please keep in touch um, with uh, uh, Sir Rex and the Six Sigma PH team when you pursue your project. No? Um, and because I think na, no, they have a wide range of experience already um, in the areas of Lean Six Sigma and process improvement. You guys are fortunate to be part of Six Sigma PH, as I did, no? because you will get tons of support when you start working on your projects um, and you actually will not need to uh, reinvent the, uh, you know, you don't need to reinvent the wheel. Just follow the coaching, um, ask relevant questions, and then you will get the targets that you are setting, uh, you are set on to. Also, um, as part of coaching, I would recommend also to keep your commu keep communications with your sponsor at all times. No? Kasi their support is pivotal in the success of and failure actually of your project. So very, very important, right? And uh, finally, um, please follow the system. No? Um, the Six Sigma circuit, no, uh, which was created by Sir Rex, I'm, I'm very grateful for the Six Sigma circuit actually. Um, um, it actually works, no? It actually works. And if you want to know how and why it works, I recommend using it Tomorrow, in your using, uh, in your chosen project, don't wait for next week. Do it tomorrow, right? Um, and while the training is good, and I applaud you for being here, um, but putting use of the learnings today will separate you from those who makes an impact in your company, in your community, uh, even in your family, and those who don't. You know? uh, conversely. Those who get uh, those people who apply their learnings um, actually are the people who get certified, right? And the others who just know it are uh, they don't get certified. Right? And siguro um at, at this stage um, I'll end by sharing this quote from an American entrepreneur um, and business leader um Andrew Carnegie um and he said that knowledge isn't power until it is applied. So thank you very much, Asik Sigma PH, for this opportunity. Thank you, Sir Rex, uh, Ms. Prizi, Celine, um, Carl, um, to share um, my Lean Six Sigma journey. And I thank my sponsors, uh, my boss, RMP, and CMOM JRS for the support in the completion of my uh, project. So with that, thank you very much. And uh, yeah, I'll give back the floor to Sir Rex. Okay, let's give again a round of applause. Okay, congratulations, Nell. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Okay. And uh, yes, so uh, aside the project, Nell, we've learned a lot from his wisdom and knowledge, diba? Right? And uh, thank you very much, Nell. Again, congratulations. And of course, we wish you all the best with your new work, okay? Of course, we believe that you could continue do doing great things at work. And marami marami salamat, Nell, and congratulations. Okay. Thank you very much. Sige, let's have a one quick photo lang, Chrissy, with Nell. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sige, so please turn on your cameras para we have a photo with Nell. Okay. And syempre, what we want is next few waves, next few months, kayo naman yung invite natin dito, di ba, to share your project, share what you've learned. 
And of course, inspire also yung next uh, waves of green belts natin. Yeah, so. Sige, on three, give me your biggest smile. One, two, three, smile. Okay. And let's give one thumbs up to Nell. Thumbs up. One, two, three. All right. Okay. Congratulations again, Neil. Thank you very much. Thank you for sharing your so, yeah, no, the course of the first uh, uh, first uh, 20 documents that they had. Uh, just for them to have a feel of um, how the new uh, process will actually benefit them and how it was easier for them to build on you know, and, and use uh, while they're writing their process documentations. Right, so that's the first one: stakeholder participation. Um, the second is that um, I would say the remote working issues. No, um, if you recall back in.